everybody, and welcome back to the Wattpad Book Club. My name is Phoenix, and uh, once again, I am joined with the lovely, lovely Kenzie on this wonderful Hello. Saturday. <laughs> Hello! I am so glad to be back once again. Yep, I'm glad to have you back. <laughs> Even, like, I mean, we did see each other like a week ago. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, you guys gotta watch the new Al Tyler video that we just did. I or while reading, yeah. go watch mm -hmm. that. It was okay. <laughs> yeah. It was an okay book. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, uh, the, the wheel spoke for us when we read, um, the, uh, the, what is it? The Dawn X Scott book. So, yeah. uh, Kenzie got to pick out which book we're gonna read. So, uh, so what what are we doing today? <laughs> we are doing Lashana X Harold or Harold X Lashana. I can't wait. <laughs> uh, me too. <laughs> I, I feel like I never see fan fiction of those two, and they were a. I feel like they were a fan favorite. Yeah, they were. All right. Well, I can't. I'm really seeing like the little cover at the bottom of the the screen. I want. I need to load this immediately. <laughs> All right, to this. All right, yep. Lashana and Harold. Yep. <laughs> what the? <laughs> Hold on. The description of this book is: Me and Harold are like unusually combination of cookies and orange juice. What? <laughs> <laughs> what? All right. Well, I guess. I guess. Uh, All right. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. And then, <laughs> this was made by. Her incense twelve. So, shout yeah. out to you. Also, this yep. is an estimated ten minutes. So I don't know how how short this is gonna be, but but I I don't know if they drew this and whatnot. But if they did, I I like it. I like Lashana's little outfit and whatnot, and the cute yeah. little tux for Harold. That yeah yeah. <laughs> Also, like, side note, I don't know why, I see this a lot, like, in cartoons and whatnot, but, uh, why is it always, when they have a ginger character, it's always, like, if it's a girl, they make her super hot, but if it's a guy what? ginger, they make him super fucking ugly. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> like, they did, my, they did my boy hero so dirty, man. Right! I would say Scott too, but I don't really like Scott to begin with, so I'll let that one pass. Yeah. But like, yeah, <laughs> damn, like, like, compare it like Izzy and Harold. They're both gingers, yeah. and like, they they are both way different in appearances of like, of like attractiveness, I guess. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but uh, all right, start reading this shit. All right, yes. these chapters are pretty short. Yeah. Which is fine. As long as it's good. As long as I'm eating good, I'll I'll be fine. I won't yeah. complain that much. <laughs> Alright. If let me just real quick go to the next Okay, these chapters are pretty short, so we can probably just do like a chapter each. Okay. Alright. So uh which do you wanna be heads or tails for this? Um I'll be tails again. Alright, so tails you read, heads I read. Alright. Alright. It's heads! Alright. Alright. Meeting Harold. Harold is all surprises. He's funny, dorky, and sk- I love that's a characteristic, because he's skinny. <laughs> Great. Yep. I am more like a Debbie cake. When me, him, and some other campers first met, I was pretty good before Harold said. Never met a girl like you before, Harold said. Oh, thank you, I said. You're very loud. You're very big and loud. I was trying to charge at him. He was doing some weird tree pose. The campers were trying so hard to break us up. Why in the world did this bony stick say I was a, I was a, I was loud? Like, come on now. We outside. I use my outside voice. If you want to, to star me, try me. You're gonna get these hands. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Wow, they- I, I forgot that at their original meeting, it was like, I never met a girl like you before, and <laughs> he's just like, you're real big and loud. Just, yeah. <laughs> like, roasting her for no reason. <laughs> Alright, well, 
Harold's apology. All right, let's see. You go ahead. Okay. Oh. Okay. Um. Hold up. <laughs> did you lose it? <laughs> I I think I did. I think I did. Oh shit. Hold on. Yeah, it's labeled um, Harold's apology. It's technically chapter two. Okay. Oh, here we go. Yep. Here we go. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. All right. Me and the other girls was in one of those cabins. I I was good, I guess. It's still standing. Harold came by. Harold came by the cabin. It's spelled by Kaplan, but that's okay. To chat with me. Okay. I just want to let you know. I'm sorry about. I'm sorry about earlier. Harold said. Aw, Lindsay said. It's okay. LOL. I forgive you. I said. You sure, Harold? Yes, I said. Harold went out and closed the door. I is he your boyfriend? Lindsay said. Yes, I said. <laughs> what? Gordon Lindsay said. No, no, no. We're just friends. I panicked. I was tired. I lay one of those two better things. You mean a bunk bed? <laughs> yeah, what? Better things? Yeah, I think, well, <laughs> that's what's in the cabins, right? They have, like, bunk beds. Yeah. I guess that's what the writer- I guess they didn't know what- I mean, to be fair, I've done <laughs> I, that before, where I just forget, like, some yeah. words and whatnot, so... Yeah! Fair. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, noon. <laughs> <laughs> right, I'm just realizing now this is Lasana's POV. I'm just. <laughs> just <realizing. Yeah. sighs> Alright, I looked out the window and Harold was kind of cute with all that dripping from his chest. L wait, like sweat? Or like he just went the, he just went the ocean? Okay, never mind. Yeah. It's so fine, I mumbled to myself. How? Heather said, coming by wearing her purple robe. Because it's none of your business, I said. I'm, wait, hold on. I got the perfect voice for Heather. I got this. Look, you ghetto low Debbie cake. I'm asking you a question, Heather said. Oh my gosh, that's perfect. <laughs> yes. I love that. <laughs> Heather was talking crap, like always. She's been pissing me off, and I'm not having it. I rolled my eyes, not putting up with her mess. I just looked out the window. Harold noticed me and went to the cabin. No, I whispered loud. All my entertainment was over. Or, that's what I thought. He came back outside. Oh, thank God. I. Oh, I think they're. Oh, thank God. I whispered out loud. Yeah. He gave me a sign language telling me to come out. Everyone else was still on. Wait. Everyone else was still on their own thing. Okay. Oh, I think still doing their own thing. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I can read. <laughs> can do things. Yeah. <laughs> also, was that... Oh. Sorry. sorry. Yeah. <laughs> For, like, uh... <laughs> was he, some, like, actually giving her, like, like actual American Sign Language, like, sing, like, actually telling her in sign language to come outside, or was he just, like, just, like, waving his hand for, like, just in general for, for that to mean... Probably, probably. I don't really know. Now, I feel like with the amount of skills that Harold has, he probably would know American Sign Language, to be honest. Yeah. He probably went to, like, what- oh, shit, what the name- like, the camps that he went to was, like, like, Mike's Sign Language Camp during, like, last summer. Sign Language summer. Camp. Yeah. He yeah. went to that. <laughs> uh-huh. I wouldn't pay him. <laughs> yeah. Alrighty, you, you <laughs> sorry. <laughs> no, 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 you're good, you're good. Outside! I grabbed the bug spray, my flashlight, and my flashlight and went out. Wiley closed the door. Ew! Bugs were crawling on my legs. I, I brushed most, most of the bugs off. You forgot one. Don't worry, I got it. He went behind me and smacked, and, and smacked mine on the behind. I grinned and realized that, that, we, that we're the only w ones there. I, I think it's gone, Harold said. Well, thanks, I guess, I said. It's crazy, but but I've kind of but I've kind of like it. But I kind of like it. I I was get it was getting late and the crickets and the crickets got loud got louder. <laughs> it, it was get, it was getting it was getting really annoying. We went we went by the dock. Hey, Lashana, Harold said. Hey, Harold, I 
Oh, hey, Lashana, Harold said. Harold said, hey, Harold, I said. I, I, was about, I was about to sit down before Harold stopped me. He grabs a large picnic blanket and lay, and lay it down. Okay, okay, now you can do it, Harold said. I forgot to spray myself, I said. Huh? Harold said. <laughs> I need to use bug spray, I said. Okay, after you finish, I got a special surprise for you, Harold said. Is it a poem? Please tell me he wrote a poem for her. Oh, yes, please. Oh my gosh, that would be that would be so cute. What was oh I forgot like the canon one that's actually in the show. Mm-hmm. Because I know Chef picked it up and he was like, for the girl with the luscious eyes, man, what the hell? And then he threw it on the plate. <laughs> right? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if we actually have one, like, established. I know we wrote haikus. Yeah. But maybe maybe we'll figure it Maybe I hope it's a poem, because that would be really in character for him. Yes. Since apparently it was it established would. that he was been writing her poems since the beginning. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Alright. Is this a date? Question mark? I hope so. <laughs> yeah, me too. I want things simple, like a teddy bear or something like that. I sat down and closed my eyes. I never knew what was going to happen tonight, but I never, but I never forgot that since that happened. I'm kind of cold. I think I need my jacket. I said. Still, arms wrapped around me. I want to open my eyes so badly. The grip from the arms starts to release. No, no, no! Please, I'm so cold. Please don't let go. Then. I hear all sorts of stuff. I hope it's not too fancy. Whatever it is, I hope it's food. I'm kinda hungry. Okay, you can open your big gorgeous eyeballs, Harold said. Lol. I, I was kinda cold, I said. You that cold? Harold said. Yeah, I said. I saw him with some spam. <laughs> <laughs> Pulled out a fucking can of spam! Well, I guess to be fair, if I was living on this island, and whatnot, and I ate chef's food, I would like a can of Spam as well. Yeah. Me guess. <laughs> Same. I love sizzle pork and meat. It's my favorite. He also got us out paper plates, paper towels, and spoons with saltine crackers. Before he was fixing the food, he, he gave me a blanket. You okay? Yeah, I'm okay now. Okay. I just want to let you know, I'm sorry about the beginning, Harold said. It's okay. It was two weeks ago. I forgive you. Y you sure? Yes. With two S's. <laughs> 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 it's, to, it's, it's to signify how she's so forgiving, you know? Yeah. I'm that's true. Bullshitting my way through this. <laughs> <laughs> we both were tearing that spam. I didn't know why, but it was so good. Well, to be fair, you were eating Chef's cooking. I think a yeah. can of Spam would taste so much better than Chef's cooking. Yeah, I agree. <laughs> if someone was watching us, I... If someone was watching us, I'd jump into that lake. It's not telling if they have cameras. It's late, dark at this time. It's no telling. This place has unexpected things going on. Like, it's scary in here sometimes. One time... I saw giant rats in here. I thought New York was bad, but here it's scary. Harold was, like, screaming and stuff when we see giant cockroaches. If I see a giant spider, I will catch a case, lol. Not playing with those things. Man, little does she know that Chef's gonna chase her around in a spider costume in, like, future ep like in a future episode. Yeah. <laughs> What's going on earlier in the cabin? Harold said. Heather, she's gonna get a slap, I said. You complaining about Heather? Huh. Let me talk about Duncan, Harold said. That school shirt kid with that green mohawk hair, I said. Yeah, he's been bullying me, Harold said. I grinned, but feel bad about, about him. I remember getting picked on just for liking Justin Bieber. Well, the middle... The, wait, the middle school was the worst time for me. Aftermath, I didn't make... 5 to 10 best friends and 15 friends. What did Duncan do? I said. Like putting peanut butter in my pants. Uh huh, is, is that right? I said. Carol got. Wait. Carol got to piss? Okay. Huh? What? I, 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 that's what it says. 
Okay. Right. Um. I hope he went by like the forest and just didn't piss in front of her. But okay. <laughs> he looked. She like that? What the? F Hold on. I'm very confused. But <laughs> we both are full and watch the moonlight and the lake. It was pretty. Hera and I were snuggling and cuddling. It seems warmer now. Hera noticed too. We were pretending it was cold. Nobody knows we're dating. So it's not a shock to Heather. She thinks she's a little Miss Perfect when she's the when she's the best. Look, don't let don't let no Duncan come between us, Harold said. Why are you what are you trying to say, I said. I was getting worried. I didn't know that Harold and Wait. I didn't know that Dun Harold and Duncan are enemies. What do you mean? He put peanut butter in his pants! Yeah, what? Feeling really that constitutes as being an enemy! <laughs> yeah. Did you not notice that? Uh, yeah. I see you flirting with him, Harold said. Look, baby, how? I said. It's the it's the language of your body, Harold said. What? Oh. They're on opposite teams. They don't even talk to each other until the merge, alright? Yeah. It's Harold, like, what is going on here? Harold, you making problems for no reason. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a little confused all of a sudden. I thought this was gonna be all like a little nice and it was gonna be like a little bit devastating when Harold gets eliminated and whatnot, but like what the fuck? <laughs> no, what is going on? <laughs> they don't even talk to one another. She and also like um does isn't like Lashana pissed at Duncan wait well, I wasn't it like on island? I think it was action when she was like really pissed at him because like he keeps messing mm -hmm. with Harold and whatnot. Yeah. So like she, she doesn't really like Duncan that much, and I don't think she liked them like that much on island. No. I don't know, man. Harold causing problems no, for no I... reason. Yeah. Harold knows that he's a two and Lashana's a ten, and he's already like already be like, you're gonna leave me and like go for another guy. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Insecure boyfriend right here. My god. Right? <laughs> Alright, you can go ahead. <laughs> uh, oh my gosh, okay. What was that? <laughs> I was so confused, trying to connect the pieces. He was so serious about it. Baby, nothing will, I said. I, I swear, I swear. I, I, I swear if, if see a connection between you two, I will yank that green mohawk off, Harold said. Jeez. My body got shivers down my spine after after I hearing that. I I was trying to hit for the kill in, until I hear the leaves crunching. I'm not playing Lashana, Harold said. He was getting up. Give me the flashlight. I, I handed it to him. What What is that? I bravely got up and... I really got up and my behind him. He turns around, look, looked at, looked at the bush. The bush was moving and stuff. Kill it, I said. Something came out and I screamed, running back to the picnic blanket. Why is it Harold scared? I went back to the bush and, and realized it was a rabbit. What is wrong with you, Harold said. Oh my god! I got gosh. so embarrassed. He would never say this. He loves those shadow like a queen, dude. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Like what? <laughs> Oh my god, yeah, he like, would never be like, on? he would never say that to Lashana, my god. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we'll continue. <laughs> I got so embarrassed that I just went back to the picnic basket. Plus, I was too tired to think right. You have a pillow in that bag, I said. We went, we went by the blanket and stand at the dock. I lay down and gradually closed my eyes. I woke up three or four hours later. Harold was next to me asleep. I kissed his forehead and went back to sleep. Boom. We we, we both quickly got up. We, we both are like, What the crap is that? Harold said. I don't know, I said. It sounds like a boom, Harold said. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, it's a boom, I said. <laughs> Harold, and I went, Harold and I were tired and stuff. We, we both went back... We, we, we both went back to our cabin. 
The people were still asleep. I changed my PJs and lay in bed. I tried to sleep, but all I could think of is Harold. I'm I missed warm skin and his geeky face and his glasses. <laughs> also, Harold is not that tough to rip fucking Duncan's hair out. My God. Yeah. Like. All right, me versus Heather. And they're about to get in a fight. <laughs> yep. Beat that bitch up. Yes. Bend her like a pretzel. <laughs> All right. All right. I can't stop thinking about him. Dang, I never, I never tell him love you or good night. Hopefully he doesn't really care. I said. Ugh. Hold on. Get up, burn crescent roll. Shut up, Heather said, with her petty oh, oh, but cuss. Can't say that. Okay. Well, I don't know what the fuck they were talking about. Okay, anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Heather, go to bed, honey. Like, like you don't ever hear anything after midnight, I say. She's lucky I didn't slap the back of her head. You're mad in the dark, and you know it, Heather said. Girl, shut up, or I'll stab you with a fork, I said. Oh my gosh. Very violent women, my god. Well, I guess right? some girl fights can get pretty violent with, like, some women yanking on, like, the earrings that some girls have, yanking <laughs> hair, and fucking, like, beating the shit out of each other. Well, I guess this is pretty accurate, then. <laughs> yeah. I wish you would, you ghetto burnt self, Heather said. That was all she needed to say. Ghetto brunt and burnt. I wanna, yep. I want to blame her with her poor vocabulary. She's too busy looking good than actually doing her work. <laughs> Heather, that you can say burnt, I said. The other girls just got up. It was so dark and the moon was still out. What's going on? Lindsay said. Nothing. I'm going back to bed. And thinking about Harold in his sexy elf. <laughs> oh my god, Lashana. Gwen said. Wait, I... You're you're nasty for a you're wait you're nasty for a ghetto mall rat is that supposed to be Heather I don't know <laughs> I think so oh is that <laughs> you're like with your future baby daddy Harold Lindsay said I was like oh my <laughs> god <laughs> Lashana <laughs> no <laughs> I never you know what I was going to bed. I, I tried. We have a challenge tomorrow, and I need all the energy I can get. I bet Harold is out cold. Shana, don't go to sleep just yet, Lindsay said. Lindsay, let's go back to bed. We got, like, three to four hours of sleep anyway, Gwen said. Don't tell her what to do, Heather said. Heather, shut up, Gwen said. You got the words out of my mouth, I said. <laughs> Heather quickly got out of bed. I was like, you little you will be punched so hard that you'd be back in your mother your dead oh mother's womb! God. Jesus Christ! If she's alive, you'd still be in her womb. Gosh. What the fuck? Jeez. Am I right? I didn't. This is fucking violent, dude. Yeah, jeez. Heather, honey, got back to bed, I said. Y'all shuts all of you, Lindsay said. We're gonna get in trouble. I laid on the bed and Heather and her Barbie doll looking self still standing up. I forced myself back to sleep. Finally, only four to five hours to sleep. And felt pretty good. I quickly ran outside, seeing if Harold was there. He was. Thank God. Hey, baby. What you doing? I said. Hey, just throwing rocks in the lake, Harold said. I bet you have a... I bet you have a lot of sleep, I said. Yep, how about you? Harold said. Not really. <laughs> Heather's crazy self pissed me off earlier, I said. Harold stopped throwing rocks and gave me a hug. I I tearing up, but have grown out of it. Oh, but having grown out of it. I stopped hugging him, we both kissed. The second best one, or was it our first one? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> 
I don't really care. I just don't. No, nada, never. We keep on... Keep on kissing before we hear leaves crunching. We, I both stop and slowly went behind the cabins. Then we resume! Okay. What? What? Oh, shit. Well, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> we ate wild berries and fish for breakfast. Don't worry. The fish are medium rare. Before we have any challenge, I and Harrow would- What? What? <laughs> I me and Harold were doing it, I think, for 30 minutes, very quick. So we have a door. Oh my god! <sighs> Alright. <laughs> we have a short time to relax. I pass out and woke up 1 to 15 minutes later. Water was thrown in my face. I realized it was Heather. I threw a pillow at her face. The reaction was priceless. Honey. Don't you dare do that again. Where's Harold? I said. Hearing the door opening was Harold, and on his and on his bathing suit, smirk came out of me. <laughs> Why oh my God. was it implied in this fanfiction that they had sex? <laughs> they just started dating! Yeah! My god, dude. Oh my gosh. What the fuck? Yeah, I got my I can't- I don't know what- I don't even know what to say to that. I- I had to like- I- 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 Like, after reading that, I like got out of my chair and everything. I- my fanfiction should not make me do that. At all. <laughs> <laughs> if it's good, it should not make me do that. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh, well, all right. Good lord. This is your chapter, bro. <laughs> <laughs> okay, me versus Tether part 2. Oh jeez. I was wondering I was wondering what he's trying to do. Sed seduce me or something. Oh my god. I can't. <laughs> the shorts are a little bit too tight, but don't mind. Heather was disgusted. She always makes me so sick. Heather, what the crap you want now, I said. Please, please don't start this again. Oh, wait, that's Harold. <laughs> Harold said, Do you think Chris will be happy about this? Oh, wait, do you think Chris will be happy about this? Heather said. Heather, Heather, tell him, I don't... Oh, 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 I, I, oh, I, I don't, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> I said. Yeah, yeah, fuck. You gag. You see me, see me gag, Heather said. He Heather, F off. He he Heather, ah. he Heather, Heather, fuck off, I said. <laughs> Look, calm down, it's gonna be alright. Look, calm down, it's gonna be alright, Heather. I mean, Harold said. Look, Lashana is such a big word. Lashana is, is such a big word, Heather said. Look. Look! Look at! Look at you! You! you look at you! 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 Look at you! You such! You! You such an H word! I said. Oh my God, dude! <laughs> oh my God. Heather is... rolled her eyes. Yeah. This is. Yeah, I know. This is. <laughs> Wait, did she just call her a hoe? What? Yeah, I think when they say such a big word, I think they meant a B word. So. I think Heather's calling her a bitch, and then Lashana's calling her a whore. <laughs> or a hoe. Yeah, yeah. Oh my gosh. I need my happy place. <laughs> Same. <laughs> rolled her eyes and Heather rolled her, rolled her eyes and walked back and walked back in the bathroom. I I follow her, but Harold holds me back. She 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 got one more time. I said. Look, stop worrying about her, please, Harold said. I sit I sit back in the bed. Harold sat next to me. We snuggle, giggle, and warming up. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I believe this is the last chapter. Me versus Chris. Damn. So fucking Chris would be like, listen, campers, you can't be having sex in the in the cabins. <laughs> Not cool, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Not cool, <dude. laughs> yeah. All right. One thing with Chris I can agree with. 
Yes. I, actually, I'll be like, Chris, I can't condone most of your actions throughout the series, but I will condone you for this one. This is- this is fire. <laughs> yes. Wait. Oh my no. god. Wait. Okay, fine. I <laughs> said me versus Chris. We kissed and kissed some more. All of all of a sudden, Chris came in the cabin. We both half clothed. Oh. Also, wait a minute. Isn't Harold just in those fucking speedo shorts? Oh my god. <laughs> Is you both doing the nasty or what? Chris said. He grabbed his. Hello everyone! Today we just got on live since the cameras were thrown on the lake! Oh, poor cameramans, I wonder how. Lashana, is- is it you? Harold said. Shut! I said, we can- What?! What is happening?! <laughs> Lashana, is that you? Harold said. Shush, I said. We kissed. So, you don't care? Look, only 10 to, 10 to 30 people will watch the stream with your unpopular self, I said. I, I can only imagine the comments being, like, stupid. Guess what? Your mom's watching you with with the boy, Lashad, I said. Does it look like I care? I said. Little girl, you better care, Heather said. Hmm, don't try me. Hey, hey, hey. y'all stop. Harold, I think you should go. He nodded and got off in the bed. Chris followed him with the camera. Harold opened the door and left. Chris was still here. Will you get the F out of here? We have the next challenge. Be ready, Lashana. End oh of my parts. Gosh. <laughs> also, I don't wow. think he could stream that. I feel like he just submitted really evidence to a certain crime that starts with C. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Jesus Christ. All right. Well, <laughs> I mean, to be oh, fair, God. in in like the first season when the when like Lindsay comes from the bow, he's straight up like implies that he was like checking her out. So I guess I wouldn't put it past him. But my God. <laughs> so, yeah. All right. <laughs> wow. I don't know how to feel about this book. It's something. For any of that. <laughs> the sex part. Yeah, I was- I thought this was gonna be a nice book where Lashana and Harold have a nice relationship before he gets kicked out and whatnot, but like... Bam. <laughs> yeah. I feel like the bar is just super low at this point. <laughs> yeah, that, that escalated super fast between them just getting to know each other to like a little bit of like starting the date and whatnot to like... They had X the next day. <laughs> what the <Yes>. hell is <laughs> that? <laughs> well, oh god. Uh, well, I guess if you guys want to check out this book, I'll have it linked down below in the description. Please don't hate the author. For fuck's sake, if I find out, oh. I will stab you. <laughs> and that's yeah, a promise. <laughs> yes, me too. I'll pull a sniper wolf and come to your house. <laughs> Same. <laughs> but, uh, well... Uh, I, I guess thank you for the book recommendation. Maybe we'll find yeah. different Lashana X Herald books. Hopefully. Yes. <laughs> well, now it's time for America's favorite game show. We spin a wheel and see how fucked we are the next time we have to sit down and record. Woohoo! My favorite! <laughs> Alright. Oh shit, well I didn't mean to do that. Well, I guess we're spinning. <laughs> uh. <laughs> I meant to just be like, alright, we got this shit now. Oh, wait, wait, hold on. Yay! What I meant to do yeah, was yeah. just, like, click off to the side and be like, Alright, we got this wheel up, but I guess the wheel really wanted to be spun. Alright, we got scenarios of total drama, which I know exactly what book that means. You guys are in for a treat, my guy. <laughs> yeah, oh joy indeed on that one. Oh my god, well... Yeah. The, the author is super good. You have nothing to worry about there. And there's a okay, lot of sure. things for us to pick and choose about which characters we want to read about and whatnot, so... Okay, I've, good. <laughs> the writing is substantial, and I've even followed the author on Instagram and whatnot. I'm a huge fan, so... Uh -huh. We're... Okay. We, we're fine. We, we don't have to worry about anything. 
<laughs> I think some oh. shorts might be a little bit like little bit of sprinkle with thing, but I think there's a warning before those, so we're, we'll be fine. Okay, good, good, it, good. It'll good. be, like, in the title what it's gonna be about, so we just gotta, like, read the title. We'll be fine. Yeah. Okay, good. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, ex oh yeah, by the way, expect a lot of Duncan ones to be on there, because they're really much a big fan of Duncan. Oh, <laughs> uh, okay. <laughs> Which is why I like the author. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Fair. But, uh, well, thank you guys for joining us on this Wattpad Book Club adventure. Uh, did you have fun, Kenzie? Yeah, I did. Did you? Did you really? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, I rate this one probably 5 out of 10. It started pretty good, and then, like, it got really yeah, weird and I sexual and whatnot. Yeah, so, I would think I, ra I rate it the same. And then, I, I say this a lot with books that we read and whatnot that turn sexual or have certain themes in it uh, mm -hmm. please make sure you put the mature tag on that and at least put a warning in the description to make sure that people please. know it, it i know it's stupid but it's just because some some people don't want to read sexual stuff you know they're maybe they're just trying to find like a cute little thing going on but like just saying, yeah you should yeah. do that <laughs> yes but uh well, well, thank you for coming on the show today. I, I appreciate it. Yep. You're I'll, welcome. I'll have Kenzie's channel linked below in the description. Uh, they they make some pretty cool content, mainly this venture camp and whatnot. So highly recommend yeah. you go follow them. Maybe <laughs> that will encourage them to post content. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yep. But uh, anyway, my name is Phoenix. Uh, that was Kenzie, and I will see you guys next time. Yep. Bye. Bye.